Hello then, Ruth. It's me again. The candid cameraman. Uh, it's uh, oh, January 26th or something. But this out of the window. This is pure Bruegel. Now, Bruegel, oh, he was a painter years ago. Uh, German guy, I think. Maybe in Dutch. Not sure. But this. Now the colours in here to you, they may just look like black and white, but there's some lovely, very, very gentle gold colours. I'm going in a bit, don't know whether it's going to come out. I'm going to take some photographs anyway, but it's, it's, well it's a contrast between, obviously, the snow, the light and the dark, But uh, I don't know what time it is. It's about five o'clock in the evening. Actually, I'm going to have to go to work at um, eleven, so I'm going to have to get my head down. But I just thought I'd take a little clip of this. I know you've not received any of these yet, and I promised him. But uh, I'm just so busy doing stuff, love. Well, I'm so busy doing nothing most of the bloody time. I'm doing something. Hang on, I'm going to... I've never been over there before, really, but... It'll get in focus in a minute, I hope. But it is lovely. And those trees, look at those. That is winter, you hear me? Mind you, I think our winter is probably... Sorry, I'm laughing again. has been better than yours. Now... I'm going to go past the, the window frame because it's a bit down at the bottom. Now the window frame's a bit of a mess, but now look at that. Eh? I'm going to try and get it nice and steady. Actually, oh, hang on, there's a couple of kids climbing up the snow. And they have no idea I'm here. Now, I'm going to zoom in on them. It's not an invasion of privacy. It's just somebody taking pictures of contemporary life. And those two children are enjoying themselves as much as we did, as much as you did, you know, when you were a kid in snow. I don't know what they're going to do now. Some are naughty, probably. Where they're going through or where they came through and they're looking back at now. It's marshland. Now, right now, it's all frozen over, so they're dead safe. Look at the colours of the hats. Oh, hang on, one slid down there. There you are. Now, look at that. Two children wandering off in the snow. I'm going to try and keep them in view, because, do you know, I've got a funny feeling that this might be a bit of fun. No, I don't mean, uh, well, what I mean is, it might just make a good little tiny piece of filming. Not that Spielberg had done it, because my bloody hands are always shaking. Truth is, love, I'm tired. I finished this morning at seven. I had about three hours sleep. It's about five o'clock now. I've got to go back at eleven. I don't mind going back, I enjoy it. But it's funny how the children have blended with the trees. I think they've dug a big hole somewhere. Hey God, I hope they don't go through the ice. No, they can't. Hang on, oh, I should have got a tripod. I mean, I should have put it on top, but, but I didn't know they were going to come, did I? Anyway. Uh, now, that will be blurred for a minute or two till this silly bloody thing starts to focus. Uh, the movement's ridiculous. Now. Now. I'm going to zoom out of those two. 
because there's two more children. Oh, look at that children with sticks. Hang on. We got a Lord of the Flies situation. Two people with sticks. And two people with no sticks. It's funny, the people with sticks are bigger. Are they intimidating the little ones? I don't know. But I'm going to keep on filming. The funny thing is, well, I can watch them on the little screen while I'm filming. And I can see them, as you might say, in real life. I'm just going in a bit. I must learn to make these zooming in things slower. It's all looking a little bit... I don't know. I don't know what they're saying to each other. I don't care, to be honest. But isn't it funny how people sticks. You know, it's a weapon. Anyway, I'm going to close this now. Because that's a nice little view. A nice little scene. Four children in the snow. Two with big sticks.